Hello everyone, are you ready for another adventure? It's me, Wookie, and I'm back with Fate Grand Order. It's been like three weeks. <laughs> the reason is, is that CCZ was going on. I was able to completely finish it, if you're wondering. I can show it off here. Um, but this is a super long-ass grind. I didn't get everything in here, but I got the stuff that was important to me. But I got this, and that's what I care about. So we're back here with uh, the Caldea Boys Collection. This event here. I'm just going to play this event. Because it's good to be back in kind of new stuff. It's not that I dislike um, CCC, by the way. It's just that, um... What's the right word for it? Anyway. Whoa. That's cool. Uh, if you end up liking the, this video, you should leave a like, comment, tell me how you've been doing with Fate Grand Order in the time being. Obviously, I've been kind of saving up a lot of stuff for just kind of uh, comma. Uh, and as I prepare for comma, the best way of doing that is to not play the game a whole bunch so I don't get tempted to summon, because I know if I had seen King Protea, which I ended up throwing like a multi or two at her, and the same thing goes for Melt, I knew I would get super tempted, so. It's like half the reason I didn't play as much, but, you know. Never really stopped playing. I was able to get the dailies and finish the event on time. So yeah, this event is only here for like a week, I think. I shouldn't have done that. Why did I do that? That was so stupid of me. That was unbelievably stupid. I didn't notice that there was only two stupid dolls here. I'm gonna completely waste my turn. Martha. Um, but yeah, this is a pretty much a stopgap. I think the next event is... Kama. And that event is super duper long too, I think. Let me see. As I... I think they could probably handle this, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> they could totally handle this. <laughs> see, smart. So we should have Caldea Boys, which we currently have, and the Antique Spider, and then Main Quest, um, Clear Campaign, Interlude Campaign, and then after the Interlude Campaign, it is right into... Tama. So, it's still actually a good time away, so just enjoy and relax just not doing anything for the time being. Other than grinding, of course. Uh, but thankfully I got plenty of stuff great, so I don't have to worry about that too much. You know, I can just sit back, wait for the day, continue to crew up, sink warts. Because let me tell you, it's uh, not easy. <laughs> it's gonna be very, very hard. A lot of tough ass banners are coming. Let me pull that up because now I should look at what's coming after that. Let me look back at that history. Yay! Finish that. So I'm going here and see what's up. I also don't have any CEs for this event because I did not pull on this banner. I like Moriarty as a person, but I gotta keep Kama. Gotta keep the stash on deck for in case. Let me also filter this out. There we go. Unfortunately, all dudes get a bonus. So no matter what, you'll see some stuff. But let me see, after comma, I wanna say is, yeah, it's not easy. After comma is the 16 million download campaign, which features, um. Mysteria Her Mysterious Heroin XX. Um, I don't think there's much in her camping. No, it's like just like Valentine's Day stuff. It's like a rerun of that. Not too bad, but if you care about her, that's very tough. And you should care about her, because she's a very good girl. Um, Gouda Gouda 3. Uh, I forget what it's called. Gouda Gouda... Oh, I wish I remembered it. It's the one with you in it. <laughs> that's what I call it. Um... Damn, it really is just kind of a pain in the butt the more I look at this. But yeah, Gouda 3 with Fokita Alter. That one's come that comes back. And then <laughs> So the month after Kama is the Case Files collab. Which features Lady Rings. And then not long after that event is the event that features I think it's Gene Alter as a scene some campaign. Yeah, it totally does. Gene Alter and um, Soliara. Soliara? 
Solieri? Yeah, Solieri is how you pronounce that name. That was a complete screw up on that part. Go here. Give my man a little bit to a little taste of that. And then it's kind of easy until June. No, and then June gets really fucking hard. <laughs> Cause that's the start of Arjun Older coming out. And then Nero Ride a week after, and then that's when we start getting ready for um Guda Final. AKA Guda 4. And then the rerun of Summer 3. And then after Summer 3 starts the anniversary. And then from then on out, it's nothing but a bad banner a month. Meaning a, a good banner a month after that, basically. And it's rough. It's real damn rough. Got any new prints? Is that what it's done? Got any new booze? No, I don't, sir. Nothing for you. Yeah, the Battle of New York, so if you want Gil, he's right there. October is Space Ishtar. Christmas is... Christmas comes early, and that's right, they fucking skip. Mm. I can't look at this, because I remember why I <laughs> haven't been looking that deep into it, because I forget they skip Lucha. That's <sighs> sad. It's very sad, but hey, what can you do? Just grind for go, for the most part. But yeah, the summon video should come back too. I, they would, um, the only reason I didn't do summon videos for the other ones is because I literally did not summon. At a certain point you have to tell the game like, yo bro, chill, please. You're hurting me. Let me go here. And that's the roughest part of any gotcha, for sure. At least this event is really cool looking. It's only here for a week. They put a lot of effort into it. Good for Moriarty. Sneaky as fuck when he's committing crime. I asked my brother if Moriarty is sneaky as fuck when he commits crime, and the reason is is that I recently was, was listening to the NWA song, Fuck the Police, and in that, <laughs> MC Ren has a line that basically lives rent free in my head, which is, I'm sneaky as fuck when I'm committing crime. And it's the most, like, <laughs> it's not that it's a bad line, it's just like the way he delivers it, it's like out of nowhere, he's like, I'm sneaky as fuck when I'm doing crime. And it's like, what? Why would he say that? He's on force, uh, his, uh, his verse, one of the better parts of it, of course, but. All the, all, all, all the parts are bangers, even the easy E part, which I'm not a big fan of it because it's kind of like strange when you listen to it i guess maybe it's just because i'm not a fan of the way easy raps specifically because he kind of goes like you are to with the jack move i just laugh I'm like you can't get into that he doesn't have the same like angry bravado that ice cube has or the kind of calming like dr dre style and mc rant's kind of just like wah, wah, wah. He has a very distinct style that I feel like either you like it or you or you don't. Hello, sir. He has a lot of HP. Only because all the male servants have bonuses here. So it makes <laughs> Berserker Wide hit a whole hard. He be hitting super duper hard if you have not been paying attention to the video. And just been listening to me. Damn, he just completely destroyed it. You know what? I might have to set up a. Because there's really, for as far as I can tell, there's really no reason for me to set up the old looping. Looping seems to be perfectly fine. That the loopy seems it seems perfectly fine with the damage bonus that you can just take out everyone pretty easily. And I only have one bonus CE, so I can just literally experiment with whatever team I want, to be honest. Oh, I have to actually play the story to hit the next part. That would require a lot of eating, so I think that's where we're getting in the video. Thank you everyone for watching this video. If you remember, if you liked it, you can leave a like. Tell me how you've been handling Fugo at the recent part. If you ended up getting um, King Protea, tell me. I would love to hear your experience with CCC if it was your first time. I think CCC is one of the best stories in Fate Grand Order. 
wrapped in one of the worst events to play. <laughs> it's like literally the one of the worst ones for me personally. It has everything I hate. It has a mission structure. It has um, and everything takes longer than three turns. It's just like everything about it is. The only thing good about the mission structure is that you get to play on BBs. You get certain like names of stuff like Breast Valley or a lot of good stuff like that. Evil El the devil's the devil's elbow stuff like that. But yeah, that's the end of today's video, everyone. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.